Uh, thank you for having me. Uh, my name is Dave Blazer. I have owned Fit Life Champions, a private personal training studio, for just coming up on six years in January. Uh, so it's not a coincidence that Nate and I are presenting on the same day. We discussed what we wanted to talk about a little bit beforehand. Uh, we are located in Denver, Colorado. Um, we discussed sharing our purpose for why we do what we do before we, uh, before we began today. And Nate said it perfectly. And I can relate a lot to his purpose because mine is bigger than personal training as well as his is bigger than massage. My purpose that I live out every day is to leave a legacy in fitness and nutrition. Hence why I did write a book earlier this year. Um, why I love to train other trainers to do what I do, but only better. Because after about three and a half years into my business, I realized that if I really wanted to reach my lifetime goal, I wouldn't be able to train 30 session hours a week in a private personal training studio much longer. I would get tired and I would get frustrated and I just wouldn't be able to impact as many lives as I possibly could. So I decided to train other trainers um, to do what I do so that when they go out and they train 30 to 50 people in the next year, then my impact and my thumbprint on the fitness and nutrition industry can be exponentially growing each and every time that I have an influence in somebody else's role. So like, like my good friend Nate, when I do bring in a personal trainer into my studio, we share the same core values, and ours are safety, education, building community, and transparency. Um, transparency is the key that I, I would like to discuss just for a quick moment. When we invite our clients in for a complimentary consultation, we're completely transparent with them about the process in which they're going to see their results. When we attach their purpose with a proper program, fitness and nutrition, we see results much quicker and much safer. And we transparently share that with our, our clients during the consultation process so that they believe in themselves that much more. I will arrive at this lifetime goal of leaving a legacy by training my peers to duplicate the sim simple systems that I implemented in my business about five years ago that saw 84% increase in revenue in just one year. And we plan to do this worldwide. We've had clients in Germany and Alabama, um, Montana, Chicago. What we need to do on a daily basis is we need to educate our community of members on the proper nutrition and fitness programs that they need to reach their goals. And then beyond that, why we're choosing an educational route today on our presentation is to educate you on the benefits of fitness and nutrition to improve mental health. I've shared Diane's story before. Uh, she came to me at a plateau. She was uh, working nights as a nurse and she could not reach her goals. She was very frustrated, she was very disappointed. In all the work that she was putting in, she just didn't have the proper plan. So she came to me for nutrition advice and she said, while, while we're talking about it, why don't we talk about workouts too? So she jumped on a hybrid program, one day a week with us in person, and three days a week online training in the gym of her choice. She lost 15 pounds, 8.5% body fat, in eight and a half months. And she said, Dave, you saved my life because when I came to you, I was contemplating suicide. <coughs> and what we found is fitness and nutrition plays a huge part in our mental health and our self-efficacy how we actually feel about ourselves when we're done accomplishing that goal that we set out to. Uh, my friend Boyce, we've, he was a former uh, teammate of mine at a hotel that I worked at. He comes to me and he says, Dave, it's not the gym. I go to the gym five or six days a week. It's my nutrition and my lifestyle. I go to McDonald's every day on the way to work and um, I love my job, but it's killing me. What do I do, need to, need, what do, I do to need to change? We said, first of all, we're gonna, we're gonna start meal prep. We're gonna take two hours on a Sunday to save you five to 10 hours of work through, uh, save five to 10 hours throughout the rest of your week. How's that sound? And he's like, that's amazing because I don't have that much extra time. If I could give myself back 10 hours a week, that would be amazing. So over the course of 16 months, he dropped 24% body fat. His goal is to leg press 1,000 pounds, squat 350, and deadlift over 400. He's accomplished two of those three since, uh, since he's made a great transformation in his own life. 